What are you girls doing? Huh? What are you girls doing? <laughs> I'm going to get rid of that somehow. And I'm in here, I just raked. And I brought a kennel in here. I brought the uh, broody jail in here, one of them. And I had one of my broodies in there the uh, day before yesterday and yesterday. Let her out this morning. Probably a little too soon because I think she's back in the box again. But I have to get ready to go pick up my new chickens tomorrow. I'm actually buying somebody else's flock that's moving. So I'm picking up 17 more birds. And I do have seven of them sold. Because I don't want 17 of them. What are you girls doing? What are you doing, pretty girls? Betty Jane, what are you getting into? You mischievous little thing, you. And uh, so I'm going to keep this in here, though, for now. Comes in really handy. And I don't have enough kennels for that many birds. So I'm taking off Monday also. So that'll give me two days to keep an eye on everyone out here. And make sure everyone gets along because normally I separate the new birds. But I, like I said, I don't have enough kennels. So they're going to have to go straight into the coop with my other girls. And uh, I've been through this enough times that, you know, there's going to be the pecking thing. But just in case... And those birds are pretty mellow. He raised them from chicks, and he could pet them and stuff. So I'm hoping, I've noticed that when the birds are, you know, a little bit more mellow um, and has been handled, they acclimate a lot faster. So I'm hoping uh, it'll go smooth. But just in case there's one, whether it's one of mine or one of his, that gets a little too mean, they can go and time out. <laughs> I know it won't be one of you girls. <laughs> uh, but I have a couple reds. Um, I'm a, I, an ISO that's a, a brat too. Eating their wet feed. They love that wet feed. And I got their fresh water over there. I've actually got three waterers. Um, and I still have to figure I might move some of this stuff around. No, I haven't cleaned that mess up over there yet. And we still don't have the sink hooked up yet. So we're ho hoping to get that done tomorrow. After we uh, get the chickens here. Um, so that's where I stand right now. So right now I'm just trying to do a cleanup because my days off alternate each week. So when I have to work four days in a row... When that week comes that I work four days in a row, <laughs> this doesn't get real cleaned up for four days, other than some little bit of spot cleaning. Um, and then pretty soon I'll have to bring a little pressure washer out here again, but I got some DE and stuff on there, but um, did some scraping. You never, you never get anything done, do you girls? <laughs> Why don't you outside? I got to fix your new your steps. They're falling apart. They're falling apart. <laughs> okay, well, I'm going to get some more stuff done. I still have to clean inside the coop yet. Get that ready. I'll probably have to buy some more boxes. I should have enough because they don't all lay at the same time anyway. Huh, how pretty girl. So I'm going to get the coop done and then get my chores done inside the house. Go back and forth as usual. <laughs> And, uh, try to get ready. Oh, I really hate that first day, though. You know, it's just so stressful. So stressful. I think they'll, they'll do good in here. You girls gonna be nice? Huh? Are you gonna be nice? Huh? You better be. You better be. Okay, well, I'm going to, I think what I'm going to do is I used to mix my own feed. Um, and then I just kind of stopped doing that in the winter time for some reason. And just, it was just too cold out for me to do that. So I think what I'm going to do is start mixing my own feed so I only have the one can. 
and then that smaller can I can keep their treats in and get rid of the rest of that stuff. That's my plan. Not that it always works out that way, but it's an idea. So, I'm going to get um, Waterer and Feeder hooked up in here just to be prepared, just in case. I don't want anything happening. So, I'll pretty much be out here keeping an eye on everyone tomorrow and Monday with just going in the house a little bit here and there to get my chores done. So hopefully this gets done and then I think I'm going to take those poles out. <laughs> They're falling over anyway. And I washed the porch and I got the wood to fix her steps. Um, and I'm going to stop at the feed store this weekend and fix, change my cans around. I'll definitely have that stuff out of here cleaned up. Girls, you better be nice, okay? Henrietta, she usually don't bother much to anybody. Bernice, you need to have a talk with the girls and tell them when the new girls get here, they need to be nice, okay? Bernice. Okay. And... Keeping an eye on the birds, George. What are you doing, Miss Princess? Huh? She'll follow me around. Oh, there, one of my broodies has come out. Okay, they're starting to wind down. And I still got to clean. I got to get the coop cleaned up. Okay, I got to get chores done. Y'all guard the chickens. You hear me? I hear crows around here, so I don't think the hawks will be coming around while they're here. Which is good. Huh. Okay, I gotta go get some more chores done.